All right, I finally got one. What do I got here? I'm at the Neosho Mill Pond and I have a limited amount of time to go fishing. It's November 1st, it's wicked nice outside, it's so glorious. I believe it's 73 degrees and I pretty much, well I ditched my family obligations. I got out of there so I could try and go fishing at the Neosho Mill Pond. More specific, right below the dam. And I've caught a lot of different things here. These are some of the different fish I've caught here. I've caught a largemouth, smallmouth, rock bass, uh, a walleye, and a channel cat, even a white bass. I don't really care what I catch. I just want to catch one fish. And I gotta do it quick, I'm running out of time. So wish me luck, here we go. <laughs> All right, the secret path to some nice fishing. Please don't fall. We're in. The number you have dialed is not in service at this time.
Rock bass don't care. Bait is just as almost as big as it. All right. I got something. Something actually decent too. Ooh, what's that? Too much drag. Oh man. I think I got a carp. Stop it. What do I got? A big northern? Maybe I got a big northern. Is that a muskie? Or a northern? Oh wow, that's a big northern. Holy crap. No, don't snap the line. I don't have my net. Whoa! You gotta be kidding me. Alright, keep it right there. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> that was a big northern. Holy shyster pops. I should have had my net. Did you see that? Oh, I'm almost glad he got off. Wow, that's a big fish. <laughs> so the other day my battery died when I was fishing at the Neosho Mill Pond, but I caught a rock bass and then the battery died. I came back today, caught another rock bass. So the first rock bass I caught, oh, it's kind of, it's in there. I caught it on the wee craw. And that's a simple lure to use. You just cast it and reel in and it just comes back with a wobble. It wobbles. The second one I caught, I caught on the uh, another crawfish lure for the rock bass. It was this, it was a soft craw, Berkeley chigger craw. I think that's what it's called. So that's what I caught the rock bass on. I let it get down towards the bottom and then I reel it in. And then the rock bass caught it. Rock bass are aggressive. They're pretty easy to catch. Time to go clean up. Let's go do this. Remember, fishermen, clean up after yourselves. It's a good thing to do.